Okay, here we go. Beautiful V. Martin alto saxophone, top of their line. And a few companies with a big monster soldered on tone holes. Um, this one's got all new pads down the front. The top, it uh, looks like there's um, the bell keys. Still have just the rivet ones. And I think a couple of the side keys are, are still um, just the rivet ones. But 99% uh, overhaul. Real clean bell. Beautiful Martin engraving. Nice and clean on the bottom. Famous uh, front screw style neck. It's actually got the liar that screws on there for your marching. Crazy uh, octave key. Really nice um, thumb octave key here. It just rolls it. It kind of fits right into here very nicely. Body nice and straight on the back. Um, of course, the adjustable thumb rest. You can see a little lacquer burn there. Somebody uh, typical gets pushed in and it sticks out too far. And so it's been repaired and um, touched up the lacquer burn. Nice guards. And of course, most important thing. table keys. Not quite the same as my uh, Yamaha Custom Series, but uh, once you get used to it, it's worth it for the sound. <laughs> Just featherweight, reminds me like of an old balanced action and such. Um, real nice pearls on it. Um, it's real nice. Of course, nothing like mine.
get the idea. Any more and it's going to cost extra and take up too much time. So here we go. Pretty darn clean for, oh, it's probably 50s, 60s. So I'm talking 50, 60 years old. So anyhow. <laughs> Anyhow, that's all you get.